All right, so what is this lawsuit we're talking about? Let's break it down a little bit. The House expected to approve a resolution today to authorize that lawsuit against the president. Republicans say the lawsuit is necessary because Obama has overstepped his executive powers. House Speaker John Boehner argues Obama violated his constitutional powers by acting alone to delay the Affordable Care Act's employer mandate, a key part of that law. Now, the Republican National Committee also pushing back against the president's speech today. Spokesman Michael Short says instead of only offering campaign speeches and policies that hurt job creation, President Obama should call on Harry Reid and the Democrat-run Senate to end their obstruction of the more than 40 jobs bills passed by the House that are still waiting for a vote. Again, Michael Short, RNC spokesman there. On the day that President pushed economic progress, numbers do back up his speech. The Commerce Department reports the economy grew 4% from April through June. The previous quarter, the economy actually shrank. The biggest reasons the numbers are up, well, we're all spending more money and businesses are too, but 2014 is still expected to see less growth overall than 2013. Unemployment rates, let's talk about those. In Kansas City, they're also inching down just a bit. The Bureau of Labor Statistics put out new numbers this morning. The rate in KC for the last month was at 6.3%. It was at 6.4% in May. Well, a butler man, wow, got the opportunity of a lifetime to introduce.